Kung Fu Ninja the Bounty Hunter. Shoot anything that moves. Oh, oh, any damn move. Hey, don't get busy. I got to talk. I gotta tell what I'm saying. This is the picture of Kung Fu Ninja. Ooh, yeah. The clue is my motherfucker. Do you know Kung Fu Ninja? Kung Fu Ninja will always take care of business. I got old truck before. Old truck, the old truck. The only thing I can try. No. Kung Fu Nigga. Wacking. Wacking hard. Working on a stakeout. He's got a stakeout. Trying to get them together. And so we're out here up. looking for who? We're looking for Six Alley. We're looking for Lil Bob, Big Bob, Urinal Bob. Urinal Bob carries Big Bob's urinal. So we're looking for him. So we can shoot this son of a bitch. You know? And we can kill him. Okay. That's $10,000 a piece. You know that, Jado? Wow. $10,000. $10,000 is a lot of money. You know that? It can buy a whole lot of cookies. Can you dig it? Yes, sir. Now, what we got to do is get these motherfuckers together and blow their damn brains out. That's what I got old trusty for. Old trusty. Your old trusty. The only thing I can yes, trust. You know? So, I figure we got to wait here for a while and we'll take care of the slack. We'll get them together. We have to stake out. Without the stake? Mm-hmm. So, this looks like a place where the invisible man might be hanging out. Hey, you never can tell. He's invisible. Still looking for him. That's $20,000 right there. Wow. Look at I know what we been... got to look at out there. I know you've been hearing certain rumors about the uh, Kung Fu nigga. You've been hearing certain rumors about him as being one of the smartest men in the world. How did you get so smart, Kung Fu nigga? Well, I'm going to have to tell you about this, Jado. In my town, they only had, like, one schoolroom and only went up to the fifth grade. So, I went through it three times. Can you dig it? So that means that I got, like, Three years of college on you already. Because you're only supposed to go to 12th grade. Mm-hmm. Now, if I went through it three times, that's 15. So I got three years of college already. That's why I'm the smartest man in the world, Jado. I see. Mm-hmm. You know something? I learned how to count to five. You know why I only learned how to count to five? Why? Because everything else after five is double. What's three and three? Six. What's five and one? Six. So what the hell I need to count for anything after five for? Hmm. Mm -hmm. I is smart, ain't I? That I, is awfully smart. I got my education. You got the education? Yes. And we staking out right here, right behind John Brown's home. Somebody's brown. Yep. Yeah, we just uh, chewing the fat and fat to chewing. Yep. Oh, we're going to take care of him. We got to, Jado. I'm so sick and tired of these spazzers around here. It's a shame. They're getting off the way with a lot of crime. Yes, 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 yes. And we are the bounty hunters of the future. Yes, sir. Yep. Come all around. Oh, oh. What, 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 what? No blah, blah, blah. No blah, blah, blah. Did I see something over there? Shit, shoot anything that moves. Oh, oh. Any damn move. Hey, don't get busy. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> don't shoot me, damn it. Oh, oh. Hmm. That looked like the invisible man. How can you tell? <laughs> I saw that leaf move. Hey, shoot it. Yeah, shoot everything that's around anyway. Who <laughs> is the engine, Jado? I can't see it. Shoot I it. can't see it. <laughs> well, I just be damned. <laughs> oh, well. So much for this type of thing. You know? Yep. Whoa, oh boy. Oh, Ain't yeah. one thing, something else.
at the stakeout. That reminds me. I once knew a man named McBass. He had two balls made out of brass. In stormy weather, they often claimed together sparks shot right out of his ass. That's something good to know. We may need that as a clue. Ooh, yes. The clueless motherfuckers. <laughs> Without a doubt. Damn, out it's all fucked up out out here. Out here at the steakhouse. Yeah, nothing going on but the birds and the bees. Yeah. Boy, oh boy. Well, Kung Fu nigga, what you think we gonna do next to catch one of them criminals? Well, this is what we got to do. We gonna mess around here, and we gonna put some tags on their ass. You know, there's one of them down there right now. We wait, till they, we wait till they get all together and stuff. You know something? That's a group of hootsie mamas. Oh, my goodness. I think we're going to have to search that shit pretty soon, aren't we? Mm. 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 Hey, Jado. What? You know something? What? I smell a rat. Oh. <laughs> ain't nothing but these two-legged ones running around here. That's all. <laughs> that's all the hell that is. You know that? Oh, we hook them up. We got to. I'm about yep. sick of this here. You know? Yep. I'm about sick of this here. This steak out here is mighty confusing to me. Oh, yes it is. It's a good thing I'm with the mightiest hero of the ghetto neighborhood. The Kung Fu Kung nigga. Kung Fu nigga. Himself. Yes it is. That's just oh. for the hell of it. I done shot one of them in the ass, didn't I? I told you we'd let them come out the house one at a time, then we shoot them, you know? Motherfuckers wow. that stole everything. Yeah, look at him hollering and shit and carrying on. He ain't gonna do nothing but go tell the rest of them. That's all right. We wait till they come out the house. And we shoot the hell out of them. Hmm. Yeah. That's $10,000. That's $10,000 right there, man. Shit, look how much gold and shit we can buy with that. Wow. Ooh. Wow. You know Kung Fu nigga is the richest man in the world, too. He's the richest man. Yes, he world. is. Yep. Mm-hmm. Right here Somebody in Somebody told me his bed was even made out of gold. Somebody even told me that his bed was made out of gold. Yeah, without a doubt. Yeah. He ain't got to worry about looking for the end of the rainbow there, do he? <laughs> yeah, shit. I'm just yeah. thinking about what I'm going to do with my money, man. You know that? That's a whole lot of money, man. I figure, I figure this way. White man paying us $20,000 to shoot each one of these bastards. You know? So I figure this way. You got it. Just shoot anything that moves around here. Don't make no damn difference. They keep fucking around, moving, shoot them. You're in the woods, what the hell can you lose? You can't miss nothing. Then, matter of fact, see that squirrel over there? Get us something to eat. Shit, I'm hungry any damn way. Yeah, that's cool. Shoot his ass. Now we got something to eat. Damn you, Jado, you done missed. <laughs> ah, what the hell? How? Well, how well, well, we just gonna have to I wasn't starve. That good I guess. shooting anyway. I can dig it. Never. But, good thing, you got old Trusty right there. Trusty, Rusty, Busty, you damn real. Mwah. Yeah. Put that in your ass. That in your ass. That in your ass. Whoa. You be all right with that. Old Trusty, look here. I even got the original leather. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> Ghetto news. <laughs> Why don't we start with the tennis? Oh. Hmm. I understand that it was two black girls that was uh, the champion. And they is bad. Hmm. They just whooping all them looks. Someone told me they was the Tiger Woods of tennis. <gasps> well, you know, we finally got a chance to have somebody up there that's going to be a credit to our race. Yeah, we need people like that because we know we can already beat them down. It's just coming up with the proof. Right. And the media don't want us to do that. Oh, no. Uh, no, never. No, no, no. Never. They they don't want that. No, 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 See, anything bad happens and stuff, they always want to blab it. Then when something good come up, they go, oh, uh, those black girls are really uh, beating everybody and... Uh, we're tired of this shit every year, you know, but uh, there's nothing you can do about it, Whitey. No, nothing, nothing at all. Nothing at all. You just got to go along with you it might and that's well it. snap out of it. There's no cloning and carrying on and nothing like that. 
Yes, you're going to have to. Because it's over with now. It is over with. Man, once one of them girls grab one of them rackets and start caning one of them peckle woods with hey. one, well, shoot, you never the game of tell. tennis will go to another level. Yes, it will. Yes, it will. Yes, it did. Yes. Yes, it did. And yes. all that money they getting, Ooh. you know. We. Yes. Slanging big booty. Big booty. Big booty. Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and like you say, Tiger Woods, though, once again, he, don't you think he's always kicking good snort? I do. I do. I think You Tiger know, there's Woods. something about that Tiger. He always comes around, you know, when he's in a clinch, he just comes right out of it, and he's showing what he's made out of. Hey, I don't never see anybody else on the field but him. Look like everything else just a commercial. Hmm. It's his show. Hey. You never can tell about that. Yeah. You never can tell. Never can tell how I'll do it. Well, so much for sports. Yeah, sports. Sports. Hey, you know the Pope? He was getting around. You see his new walk? He's oh, getting cooler. Yeah. He's getting cooler. That's because That's someone told me he went to Compton. You know? He went down up in there. Oh. Yeah. yeah. After they got through with him, mm. he had a hell of a walk trying to yeah. get the hell up out of there. Oh, hey, yeah. I understood he got pickpocket. Yeah, they try to take all that gold off of him. Uh, no idea. Oh, yeah. Going, he into was a loaded. going into an unfamiliar neighborhood. In the pimp mo unit, too? Mm. The Pope pimp mobile? Oh, man. I wanted one of those one time. Yeah. yeah we all can't have everything in life. Sometimes you just got to work and work and work and for a million years, and you might be able to get one breadcrumb. Yeah. Yeah, after yeah. taxes, what the hell. Yeah, well, he went home, and he saw his people. They had a pope over there in Italy. No, Poland somewhere, wasn't it? Well, who knows? Ain't he a Polak? The pope? Ain't he a Polak? Polak, pope, yep. Yeah. It's about he the sure size is. of it. Yeah, he is. <laughs> yeah. Well, well, so much about religion. Yeah. We might as well go ahead on and move on to some more pertinent things that is happening in the world. Like local news. Ooh. You know that one motherfucker, man? Let me tell you, man. He was supposed to... That dude was supposed to come and clean off my back porch. I paid him $20 to start it off. I told him I'd give him $40 just to do that. Oh he had nothing goodness. but to do but to do a little sweeping. And did you know he took the $20 and left off? You know who I'm talking about. Oh, over. my goodness. Smugger man over he there. He went and did the McMurphy on you, huh? Yeah, he did. No good. This local ghetto news, people. Watch out for Smirky Lou. Oh. Smirky Lou will. Oh, my shoot goodness. You. Oh, my goodness. And you're still looking for him. Yep. Hmm. Exactly. Well, Always. that goes down to a whole line. Everybody else that's looking for him, too, I heard. This oh. ain't the first time he pulled that type of stuff. Uh. And then, you know something? The same identical thing happened to me. You know what? what? I went and cut this guy's grass for him and stuff and huh? carried on. He'd been ducking me for a month. For a whole month. I didn't went over to the islands and came back and did everything else and he's still ducking me. You mean right down the way? Yeah, there? he's glued to his house. He's inside of there glued in there. Uh, yeah. So you never, you never can tell. Your neighbor. If that's not ghetto news, I don't know what the I hell don't know is. What I bet you that. Now nah, that's ghetto news. Huh. So we might as well go on and move on to some regional news then, huh, Wiley? Oh, yes. What's happening in the region down there with Taft and them? What's Taft and them doing down there? Running Columbus and can on. They be have, I like them niggas down there in Columbus because we always have a good time in Columbus. Well, you know that's yep, our capital. Do. That's Columbus, Ohio. Ohio. That's right. You, you ever heard of Ohio State? Exactly. That's exactly where about. it is. That's right. Yep. Yes, sir. Now, I understand that he think this is a planation he running around here. Hmm. Like he got everybody, can tell everybody what to do, and like us, and expect us to like it, and root for him. Huh. I think he's trying to get us in another war. That's what that is, you know? Oh. Yeah. Oh, When he yeah. comes up here, I'm going to ask him about this here. You know yeah. what I mean? This situation here. 
Yeah. Oh, see, can yeah. you see? Can you fetch him up here and let's see what the deal is? Oh find, yeah, we could get his ass here. Go on and find get find Bush. Go here. find Bush. I got some Shit. questions for him. Huh. You have something to say to me, son? Well, hello, <laughs> here's the president. Hey, how, how you, you doing, doing, boy? Yeah. <laughs> Good I to voted see for you. you too. Good to be on your show. <laughs> <laughs> well, I've been hearing a whole lot about you. You know, here yeah, the last yeah, you ought to. Yeah, because you know, you know, my dad used to be president. <laughs> yeah, I know you was behind some bush. Yeah, 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 yeah. We're really working things, you know. Uh, our, you know, yeah. Let me tell you. Let, let, why don't you listen to a story about a well, man why named not? Jed? Oh yeah. A poor man there, barely kept his family fed. Mm -hmm. Then one day he was shooting for some food. And up through the ground come a bubbling crew. Oil, oh, that mm -hmm. is Texas tea. I can understand yeah. that. Yeah, yeah. We had to show him what was what this year uh, at the presidential election and everything. You know, my brother Jed took care of things real nice down there. Yes, he did. Yeah, yeah he, he did. did. He showed you guys really what was going on. Mm -hmm. And uh, I, I, <laughs> I had to give old Clinton the boot. <laughs> well, because I'm a Bush, you know. I'm a Bush. I'm the president right now. Hmm. And, yes, well, you are. We blew up the World Trade Center just to show everyone that we could come up with our own military alignment with home securities, you know. Yeah. Yeah. And uh, right now... We have things pretty much under control. All of the little tyrants that were calling themselves running around trying to disrupt governments such as ours. Uh, well, yeah, the World Trade Center showed you all that um, homeland securities will be on the case from now on. The military has nothing to do with this. I'm running this on my own. Well, this what is do you my ad hoc project? Well, do you think you're ever going to catch the catch the guy that's behind all this? You know, I heard he's been hiding and carrying on and uh. Oh yeah, you're referring to Bim Lobby. Yes, you're yes, referring, yes. You're referring to Bim Lobby. Yes, I well, am. You know those people there? They wanted my dad too. Yeah. You know those people wanted my dad. Oh yes. And well, I had to come back and I'm sorry. I I had to go through there and. Kick their asses, so to speak. You know, well, we're on ghetto news here. Well, I can yes, talk yes like you this, can so say I... ass because you are sitting on the one. Exactly. Right. Hey. Yeah. Do you know who I am? Yes. Who? You are the man behind the man. The man behind the man. Hey. This guy's cool. He knows what's going on. That's right. I am the president of these United States now. Now, we got war going on here, and yep. I'll be making sure that everything is, can I say, cool. Yes, you can. Well, everything will be cool, Homer. Well, I'm glad to uh, yeah. see that you can understand this, well, you I'm know? Well, I'm running this, because I'm a bush. Yeah. I'm a bush, and my dad's a bush, and we run this country. Don't you know my dad knew everything about security in this country before I even got in the office? I've had yep. the opportunity to be able to expand upon that so that I could get more, <laughs> you know. I heard you was investigating. I heard that you was investigating those hidden rooms in there so you can get in and out of there quicker than what you was. You know what I mean? You yeah. found some of those hidden rooms in yeah. there. Yeah, yeah, I done that. I, I. Fully looked over the quarters, and uh, there are a few tunnels that I haven't been in, but they're so dingy and dirty. I I wouldn't dirty myself to even uh, <laughs> I'm I'm really a domesticated type person, you see. Mm -hmm. I I prefer to send my generals out to do the dirty work. You I understand, can understand now, that. Man. Well, yeah. I know you have pressing things to do, and you are running our country, and you your time is very limited. Yeah. yeah so, uh... Yes, it is. And, uh, yeah. And being the first uh, person on your show, which I should have been, being the president. You know, yes. Yeah. Uh, I, I, I just want to thank you once again, and I want you to know, yeah. and I want you to let the rest of America know that uh, this country is in good hands with the Bush. With the Bush.
Exactly. Okay, then. Go get them, Bush boys. Thank no. you. <laughs> it's nice talking to you, President. All right, nice you're talking. Wow, Wiley, that was some interview with the President of the United States you just had there. Well, sir. you never can tell. We always have exciting guests on this show. Yes, sir. And this is ghetto news. <laughs> Well, I'm looking through, Chan, through the bounty bag. We got to go collect that bounty. Yep. There's some treats in here now, because we caught a lot of people. Hey, Jado. Hey, I got I got the goods. I got them. That's good I got them. What took so long? You never can tell. Ugh. A lot of mountains across, boy. Yeah, it was. Yeah, it was. Woo. I ran all the way. I was able to handle it. I can understand, and I'm glad somebody was running from somewhere. Yep, I got the bounty right here. That's good. Yep. That's how much money we gonna have? Hey, hold it, hold it. Did you see? Did you see that group that was over there, Yana? You mean to tell me we gotta get some more money? I thought we was off on break. They're Mr. Snitches. Ha. <laughs> well, good thing I got old Trusty around here. You know. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> yep. We ain't got to worry about this type of thing, now, do we? So don't. Huh. Yep, we got the goods here. Well, you better let's, believe it. Let's see what we got, Chan, in the bounty bag. Well, how about a drink? What, here you go. You know, a little fire water always is a... Well, you is the Indian. <laughs> <laughs> That'll go here on your chest. <laughs> Thank you, Kung Fu nigga. That's some awfully good stuff. That's Henry the 13th there. Tell me about it. Fine vintage. Ooh. $2,000 for that little bottle. <laughs> Take good bounty to do that. Well, it's a good thing we got plenty of gold. Tell me about it. Plenty of gold. Want to yep. make sure it's all that? Well, Kung Fu nigga trust you. I'm counting every damn piece. <laughs> Good old gold. Mm, good old. Oh, I didn't love it. Oh my. Yeah, take a bath with it. Yep, I can good understand that. Yep. Yep. Good too. Ooh. Hey, that one piece scratched me down there. You never Ouch. can tell about Ouch. that. You know? It had a burr on it. You know, uh, throughout our travels and stuff and everything, I acquired different things, you know what I mean? Yep. And one was this damn bird, you know? Yeah. You know I was he was a good friend. He's a good Do you friend. know Kung Fu nigga? Kung Fu nigga, Kung Fu nigga. Do you know Kung Fu nigga? Do you know Kung Fu nigga? Do you know Kung Fu nigga? Do you think he know any damn thing? He know any damn thing? He know any damn thing? He know something. Yes. yes. I ain't had nothing but trouble out of this damn thing ever since I bought it. You know that? This damn thing ever since I bought it. Where were we at over there now? Over there now. Over there now. You Guinea. Yeah. You yeah. Guinea. Yeah. Where were we at? Yeah. Getting yeah. the new Guinea yeas. We Ooh. got new guineas. We got him right here. In the, we got him right here. That's why he go around eating everybody. Ooh. Oh. Oh, we got him right here too. Good. But I didn't know which time for you to take a rest. Take a rest. Take a rest. You gotta take a rest. You know that. You gotta take a rest. You know that. You gotta take a rest. You know that. Boy, he talk more shit than a little bit. Oh, he go on and on and on, man. You know what I mean? You know, oh yeah, we got the one monkey. We caught him. That's well, we good. just caught his hand because he saw something shiny. Well, I bet you one thing. The way the world's going through now, they're going to need more niggas like us. You know what I mean? I bet you that. Now nah, that's ghetto news. Huh. One of the presidents has just entered. Well, good. Let's we'll find out which one it is. It's President Nixon. Hey there, homer root boy. <laughs> yeah, what's this? Your dribble off, huh? Hey, hey, watch the hair, buddy. Watch the hair. Hey, watch the hair. Hey, I know you got a. I know you got a whole army. I know you got a whole army with you hey. and everything. You know. Hey, hey, let me first things first, okay, bud. First things first, okay, bud. Well, you're on my show, and when you're on my show, I tell you what to do. You don't tell me what to do. Okay, can I ask you this one question, then, so? Give it a shot. All right. I want to cock me an ounce of that key blow. <laughs> I want, I want, I want the real guns, man. You want, want the real the, deal? Yes, sir. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, you got to go want... further than here to try to find something, buddy. That's oh. for sure. What? Hey, 
Don't you know I used to be the president of this country? Yeah, I heard something about I you. I be able to go I heard something about you and some in tapes. any of these streets. I heard something about you and some tapes. What? This is ghetto news, right? Yes. I'm and that's where you... I'm president and I'm here in the ghetto. And, hey, man, I just want to cop me an ounce of that key blow, man. I understand you got some good shit. Do you mind sharing you something can't with me, get any. You can't get anything like that anywhere around here. It's not this, why. You know why? Man, because. when I was in office. <laughs> yeah, everything was going to pot. Hey, I had good shit. We had the Colombian red. We had Panama red. We had the gone. Yes. Yeah. 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 And it cost a lot of money then, you know. Oh, money's no problem. I used to you. pay. I used to pay up to. Listen here now. Listen here. I used to pay up to a million dollars for just a little dime bag of that good conj. Hmm. And I loved every single bag. Yeah, let me tell you. <laughs> you better be I glad you it. didn't get caught with that. You'd have been kicked out of that office sooner than what you was. Hey, bud, well, I need me some with some of these right here. I could have been fully camouflaged, you know? Yeah, you could have. Yeah. Yeah. All you had to do is keep that grease out of your head and mess around here and get it braided up and dreadlocked. Then you'd be all right. Hey. You hear you me, Monty? You, you think mine will do that there? Quite naturally. Think mine will do that? But you need some ribbons in yours. Oh, yeah. Oh. Look. I used to be the president of those hell United States. It used to be Wooster. Now it's used to have a new. <laughs> yeah. I can take a picture here with Walt. Yeah, I see I see yeah. one damn thing. I see that this interview is going the hell out. Now that's ghetto news. Huh. Huh. I bet you that. Now that's ghetto news. Huh. That was some good stuff, wasn't it? Ooh, without a doubt. Very well good. Look how much money that stuff costs. Woo, Jado, slow down. Woo! <laughs> 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 oh, oh, my wonder. ears is running out earwax. Hold it. Hold it. <laughs> no wonder he keeps it around his neck. <laughs> hey, hold it. Hold it. Hold it. Uh-oh. You're always trying to drum up some business, you know that? Always. Scouting out the area. Trying to put up the slack. Well, I think we got them all around here now. Well, I guess the ghetto's gonna be safe for a while, you know that? Yes, sir. But always keep a lookout for them, because you never can tell. You never can tell. Who's that over there, Kung Fu nigga? Hey. Over there. That's just the Six Sal gang. That's all That's that is. Six cell game. Oh yeah, remember Sick of cell. Sick remember, of cell. We didn't catch all of them, we just caught some of them. Yep, remember remember we caught Sulu Sick of Cell? Yeah. Well this right here, I remember I had I remember I had his hand. I had his hand in my pocket for so long it shrunk to this little. Ooh. You can well, always take that wrong. in, you know what I mean? Because he had a tattoo right on the left knuckle there and I can see it. There it is. is. It that says is mother. It's reduced. It says mother. Yep. That's the true sick of sal. Hey, that's good. Yep. You know yep. that? Oh, oh, we're keeping the bounty right up here. We'll see what it is. Now, we got the gold. Got the gold. We got the gold. Got the finger. What do you see? I thought I heard something. Because he's spying on some dinner or I something? I thought I heard something over there. Boy. I, I thought I heard something over there. So I wish you could find something around okay. here, man. Oh, 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 oh. I got something here, Kung Fu nigga. Grab sack. Look here, look here. What I, what I caught. While I was on the way down, I caught an eagle. Oh yeah. I caught an eagle. Yeah. So I took off some feathers on him, and I thought I'd give you one. Yeah. And I'm gonna replace this and put this one back up in my head. Can understand that. I'm gonna put this one back up in my head. This. Jado, you know you a true engine. Hey, I never seen the eagle before. <laughs> <laughs> well, you shot him in the ass and got the feather, so you must be pretty slick. That's for sure. Well, we, I got him. I bet you that. But look at here. Remember when we caught the one monkey that don't stop no show? Ooh, it was difficult. It was a difficult task. Yes, sir. He Very was going difficult. on and on, on and on. Past the break God of dawn. You had to shoot him to shut him up. He was the one monkey that don't stop no show. Boy, 
You know that? He told all the rappers what they rap and rhyme to get over here and stand in line because his sound surpasses space and time. His stuff went on and on past the break of dawn. Because one monkey don't stop no, no show. Now that's ghetto news. Huh. Ghetto news. Ghetto news. Ghetto news. Huh. Kung Fu Nigga the Bounty Hunter. <laughs> Shoot anything that moves. Oh, oh, any damn move. They don't get busy. I got to talk. I got to smell what I'm saying. This, this is the picture come from Fu Nigga. Ooh, yeah. The clue is my Do you know Kung Fu Nigga? Kung Fu Nigga will always take care of business. They, 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 they don't. Hook them up. I got old truck before. We're sorry to inform you people that the show has been cut very shortly because of our time limit. Why do you didn't want to give us the whole time period, you know? Because he knows there's going to be some bullshit on this fucking show.